What do you do when your dog barks too much or the family cat stops going in the box? Well, thanks to technology, there's a lot of information available, some good and bad, in an instant. But can you trust the pet experts on the internet? For most pet owners, the family veterinarian is the number one source of advice for their pet's medical needs. But increasingly, a number of so-called animal experts have exploded onto TV and the internet. We've all seen TV shows with breeders, trainers, and even pet psychics giving advice. Thousands of websites and blogs offer guidance on training, behavior, and other aspects of veterinary care. Certainly some of these sites have good advice on behavioral issues and even breed-specific items. But when is it okay to take advice from someone other than your veterinarian? The letters DVM or VMD designate a doctor of veterinary medicine who has graduated from an accredited university program. Just like human doctors, veterinarians also specialize in surgery, internal medicine, dentistry, and even exotic pets. They've spent years learning the best care for your pet. Even so, for quick advice, you'll often go to the internet. Start with your veterinarian's website. They probably have links to trusted sites. Some other good places are veterinarypartners.com, animalhealthcare.ca, petplace.com, and PetStyle.com. These are a few trustworthy sites on the web, but the best place to start is always with the person who knows your pet best. Almost anyone can claim to be an expert on the internet, but it takes years of study and dedication to become a true animal health care specialist. Play it safe. Talk with your veterinarian about any medical or behavioral needs your pets have. I'm Dr. Jim Humphreys reporting.